Glass, glass, and more glass. This is what fills the front room at Russell and Adele Lewis's A Touch of Glass Studio in Idaho Falls. It's located right on Cliffside Lane, up on a hill. From recycled bottles to ornaments to even home interior, the Touch of Glass Studio can do just about anything. It's made with a lot of heart. It's unique art. It's something you never see. We're, we're so unique, there's just nobody else around that does it. Adele and Russell have made this glass studio their own husband and wife business. It's been around since 1991-1992, but they have been in this current location for about five years. It looks like a house from the outside, and that's because it is. They conveniently built their studio adjacent to their own home. But inside their shop are delicate and intricate pieces of all kinds. Tools are in the back as you can see a real workshop and look at some of the work being done. Their glass ventures first started out as a hobby rather than a business. What's most impressive is that their work was all self-taught before they began. Adele explained how she had a fascination with glass. Russell then decided to pick up glass work in his spare time, back when he was a pipe fitter, and taught Adele how to do it. Now he creates all sorts of beautiful pieces along with his wife. I've been doing it not near as long as him, probably about 15 years for myself, and he's been doing it for 25. This is the process of glass blowing an ornament. What Russell does first is light the torch and uses Pyrex glass, which is durable for just about anything. He heats and stretches it out, cracks the end off, and then pours some frit into it which is crushed up pieces of colored glass. Then roll it and start to uh, get some heat in it and it'll start to collect those, those little pieces of fret. You can see that he has a blow hose in his mouth that is hooked to the glass tube in order to blow the shape. After that, it's a matter of heating, rolling, and blowing it into the round shape it needs in order to be an ornament. You know, it's, it's, the nice thing about it is, is something that we thoroughly enjoy doing. The ornament is then placed in an oven overnight in 1,050 degrees Fahrenheit, where it gets a fiery orange glow to it. It's then taken out the next day to give its finishing touches. They also do sandblasting, engravings, and slumped infused glass work. And what about starting your own business like this one? A lot of hands-on, self-taught, burnt fingers, <laughs> lots of practice and trial and error. You have to put, you have to want it pretty bad to you know, to stick it out and, and turn it into a business because it's a lot of work and a lot of frustration and, you know, figuring things out. But that paid off for Adele and Russell as they have made 250 Christmas ornaments for the state capitol in Boise. They even have gone to local art shows and as far as Jackson Hole, Wyoming, and continue to climb in their business. They have $2 ornaments and prices ranging to $1,000 for larger pieces that they do. And the designs and themes for their glass are limitless. Coasters, Christmas, pizzas of pizza, you name it. What's Russell's favorite pieces to make? I love doing wildlife art. You know, I like doing trout and elk and, and they all, you know, in this country they sell well. And it's seen throughout the shop. Each part of glass in the studio shows a bit of Adele and Russell's personality, which makes the art so likable. There's just not that many of us left anymore. Reporting at a touch of glass studio in Idaho Falls, Andrea Olson, Upper Valley, Idaho.